Since the dawn of humankind, science has embarked us on a perpetual journey into the dark waters of the unknown, fueling our curiosity and pushing our boundaries. This journey is filled with unexpected, astonishing, and sometimes bewildering discoveries. Yet beyond these discoveries, there exist phenomena that remain largely unexplained, baffling even the brightest minds in the scientific community. Today, we will delve into phenomena emerging from the depths of our world and the cosmos, which remain not fully understood. Before we begin, don't forget to subscribe to my channel to stay updated on the latest videos. Let's get it on! The Blob Meet the Blob, scientifically known as Physarum polycephalum, a unique entity that can learn in various ways despite lacking intelligence, hosts nearly 720 genders, yet isn't considered an organism in the traditional sense because it's unicellular. This entity is deemed one of the most mysterious beings in the biological world. Blob typically resides in damp, dark places, forest floors, and decaying vegetation. It sustains itself by consuming dead organic matter in its vicinity, primarily bacteria, yeasts, and fungal spores, significantly contributing to the forest ecosystem. This being, recognized for having about 720 different genders, boosts its species' adaptability through heightened genetic diversity. Although the blob is a type of slime mold, it cannot be classified as either an animal or a plant. Despite its brainlessness, the blob possesses a kind of learning ability. Various experiments have demonstrated its capacity to utilize memory and adapt to environmental stimuli. For instance, it has displayed proficiency in finding the quickest route to a food source during maze experiments. Genetically, this entity can alter a portion of its genetic material according to environmental conditions, harboring potential applications in biotechnology and bioengineering. The scientific community is currently developing strategies for the conservation and sustainable management of this species, fostering further research into its ecological and genetic aspects. The WOW Signal Behold the WOW signal, the strongest radio signal ever captured, emanating from the unknown depths of space. It derived its name from a note penned by astronomer Dr. Jerry R. Amon when he first observed this enigmatic signal. On August 15, 1977, the Big Ear Radio Telescope of Ohio State University picked up a radio frequency signal that lasted for approximately 72 seconds. This signal vastly surpassed the levels of background radiation usually observed, leading Dr. Amon to express his astonishment by scribbling WOW on the corner of the paper where the signal was recorded. The origin of the signal seems to be the Sagittarius star group, a source that remains unidentified to date. This signal stirred great excitement among scientists within the project known as SETI, which seeks to establish communication with extraterrestrial life forms. The frequency of the signal was notably close to the natural radio wave frequency of hydrogen, spawning speculations that it might have been transmitted by an alien civilization. Given that hydrogen is the most abundant element known in the universe, it was hypothesized that this frequency could potentially be a channel utilized by one alien civilization to communicate with another. The signal was received only once and has never been repeated. Over the years, numerous researchers and space enthusiasts have pursued the mystery of this signal, yet no concrete explanation has been provided thus far. This has resulted in a plethora of theories and speculations about the nature and origin of the signal, with some positing it as a beacon for interstellar communication, while others conjecture it to be a natural phenomenon or a fragment of an extraterrestrial source. The WOW signal remains a mystic chapter in the fields of astronomy and astrophysics, and we are likely to continue witnessing myriad theories being developed about the origins and nature of this signal. For now, it persists as one of the grandest and most captivating mysteries in the scientific world. Tabby's Star as scientists peer into the depths of the sky with a telescope, they occasionally encounter such peculiar phenomena that spawn a host of speculations and curiosity. One such event is the case of KIC 8462852, -8 also known as Tabby's Star. This star entered the radar of every astronomer and space enthusiast in 2015, owing to the strange light fluctuations surrounding it. Astronomers typically anticipate such fluctuations due to a planet revolving around a star, but the magnitude and irregularity of the fluctuations at KIC 8462852 completely dispel such an explanation. 
This specific star has been named after the astronomer Tabitha Boyajian. Boyajian was the first person to identify these bizarre occurrences in the star's orbit, and since then, this phenomenon has provoked a range of theories, including the possible intervention of an extraterrestrial civilization, because these fluctuations forsake any regularity and symmetry that would suggest a regular planetary transit system. Some of the fluctuations have reduced the star's light by as much as 22%, which is a much larger effect than what a planet could cause. Scientists have conducted a series of researches to unravel the reasons behind this phenomenon. While some propose that a cluster of comets composed of dust and gas around the star might be causing this, others argue that there is a strange and abnormal activity occurring within the star itself. However, so far, no theory has been entirely satisfactory, and the mystery of KIC 8462852 remains a significant enigma in the scientific world. Ball Lightning Amid the roaring storms in the sky, there are lightning bolts that showcase their electrical dances, tearing through the darkness of the night. However, among these lightnings, there exists a rare, extraordinary, and mysterious phenomenon, ball lightning. Although this phenomenon has been reported by eyewitnesses for several centuries, its nature continues to remain largely a mystery. Unlike a traditional lightning bolt, this strange phenomenon manifests as a spherical, luminous sphere and can sustain its existence for seconds, even minutes. The scientific community has proposed various theories over the years to understand what ball lightning is and how it forms. One theory suggests it is a plasma created by vaporized silicon particles formed during lightning strikes. Another theory claims it to be a kind of energy ball that emerges as a result of lightning electrically dissociating certain molecules in the atmosphere. Regardless of the true nature of ball lightning, eyewitnesses have reported the mysterious phenomenon appearing mostly during stormy weather conditions, even sometimes indoors. These witnesses detail that ball lightning is often observed as a bright and spherical light ball, sometimes accompanied by strange movements and even explosions. This phenomenon has appeared in many different colors, yellow, green, orange, and even blue. The Taos Hum In one of the quiet corners of Southwest America, the town of Taos in New Mexico is famous for an unsolved phenomenon. For years, this small community has been trying to solve the mystery of a mysterious sound that is almost as faint as a whisper to the rest of the world, but a constant source of noise for the local populace. This enigmatic sound has been named the Taos Hum. This low-frequency noise heard in the town of Taos has actually been reported in many places worldwide, but its source has never been definitively identified. The Taos hum has been reported by the locals since the early 1990s. Moreover, the sound can only be heard by specific individuals. A small percentage of the residents in the town hear this noise, while for others, this noise essentially does not exist. The mystery of the Taos hum lies in the fact that the phenomenon can only be heard by a certain group of people, and the exact source of this sound cannot be determined. Many theories have been proposed regarding the Taos hum. Among these theories, it has been suggested that the phenomenon arises from various sources such as low-frequency radio waves, underground mining activities, or even distant traffic noise. However, many investigations conducted so far have been unable to identify the source of this mysterious sound, and the Taos hum phenomenon continues to remain a mystery in the scientific world. Furthermore, the Taos hum has become a cultural and social phenomenon beyond just being an acoustic anomaly. Locals and visitors have pursued this mysterious sound, investigated its source, and attempted to solve the unsolved mystery of this unusual event. Pandora Viruses Pandora viruses are a family of viruses first discovered in 2013, causing a revolution in the field of microbiology due to their size and genetic diversity. These viruses are identified as the largest known viruses, with some measuring up to one micrometer in length, potentially as large as a bacterial cell. The viruses derive their name from Pandora's box in ancient Greek mythology. This is because during the investigation of the genetic diversity of these viruses, scientists encountered numerous surprises. Their genomes possess a wide genetic diversity and contain many genes that have not yet been fully defined by scientists. 
Some of these genes do not show any similarity to those of other known living organisms, indicating that Pandora viruses could shed new light on the evolution of life. A research published by NCBI states that the genetic structure of Pandora viruses stands apart from other known organisms and viruses. At the same time, the environmental impacts of Pandora viruses are a significant source of concern. An article in The Conversation suggests that global warming could lead to the release of deadly microorganisms, especially Pandora viruses, posing a serious risk for global health and environmental policies. In Pursuit of Dark Matter In the dark corners of the universe, there lies a mystery that telescopes cannot see, a secret that not even light can touch. This is not an astronomical ghost story, but the current state of modern physics science. Dark matter is something that constitutes a large part of the universe, but we still do not fully understand what it is. Dark matter is a theory first proposed in the early 1930s by Fritz Zwicky, based on the inability of the observed masses of galaxies to explain their calculated masses. This mysterious matter can only be detected through its gravitational effects, but it has not yet been observed directly, making it one of the greatest enigmas in cosmology and particle physics. Dark matter makes up about 27% of the total mass of the universe. Unlike normal matter, it does not interact with electromagnetic forces, so it neither emits nor absorbs light. This property makes observing it extremely difficult. Very little is known about the nature of dark matter, but it is believed to play a critical role in the formation of galaxies and galaxy clusters. Various laboratories and telescopes are developing new techniques and tools to detect this mysterious matter. But is dark matter just a hypothesis, or does it really exist? As scientists search for the answer to this question, they are conducting a series of experiments and observations to detect dark matter. This could be a discovery that helps us understand the fundamental nature of the universe and heralds a new era in science. Mysterious Screams of the Mariana Trench On our planet, there are many secrets yet to be fully unraveled for the ever-exploring world of science. One of these secrets is, undoubtedly, the sounds rising from the depths of the Mariana Trench that astonish scientists. These sounds have become a phenomenon dragging not only the scientific community, but also curious individuals in its wake. So what is the truth behind these sounds? The Mariana Trench, known as the deepest oceanic trench on Earth, harbors many unknowns in its depths. This trench is one of the deepest on Earth, with a depth of about 36,000 feet, a distance even greater than from the summit to the base of Mount Everest. It is in this tremendous depth that researchers are trying to discover the source of some extraordinary sounds. These sounds were first perceived a few years ago during submarine research. Characteristically, these screams or howls remind one of the painful cries of an animal, However, the existence of an animal living at these depths has not yet been discovered by the scientific community. This situation raises questions about whether the sounds are a kind of biological phenomenon or the product of another natural process. Some believe that these sounds belong to large sea creatures living in the depths and yet to be discovered. Others propose that they might be related to geological activities or movements at the sea floor. There are also suggestions that the sounds might be associated with extraterrestrial life forms. In order to test the accuracy of these theories and solve this mystery, scientists are conducting intensive research in the Mariana Trench. This research is being carried out using dives into the depths of the Mariana Trench and devices that record the sounds at these depths. So far, no concrete evidence regarding the source of these sounds has been obtained, but researchers continue their work with the hope of unraveling the mystery. Ghost Particles One of the phenomena that science has not yet fully explained is neutrinos, one of the fundamental building blocks of our universe, also known as ghost particles. Neutrinos appear as one of the most mysterious and least understood particles of matter. Their mass is almost negligible, making them particles capable of moving at speeds close to the speed of light. These tiny ghosts are just a few of the billions of particles emitted by stars beyond our Earth and our Sun. Among their unique properties is the ability to pass through almost all materials without any problem. This shadowy journey of neutrinos excites physicists and astrophysicists because neutrinos interact very little with matter, making them extremely difficult to detect. However, the adventure of these ghost particles is not at all easy. 
Leading research institutions around the world, like CERN, continually conduct research to better understand the nature of neutrinos and their role in our universe. Ghost particles can play a significant role in unraveling the secrets of the universe, and perhaps one day, with their help, we will be able to reach the deepest secrets of the universe. The Phantom Darkness of Space Exploring the vast depths of space has been one of humanity's greatest and most mysterious adventures. At the center of these adventures lies the Cosmic Microwave Background Radiation, commonly referred to as the CMB, and a mysterious portion of it known as the Phantom Darkness of Space. This is a phenomenon that even in the scientific community has not been fully explained yet and remains a field filled with theories and speculations. The cosmic microwave background radiation consists of light waves that formed in the initial moments after the Big Bang, distributed homogeneously throughout the entire universe. Studying the CMB allows us to understand the age, structure, and components of the universe. However, within these light waves, there are certain areas, referred to by scientists as the phantom darkness of space, that are abnormal and unexplained. In these areas, the light waves have lower temperatures than expected, creating a sort of cosmic shadow. The phenomenon of the phantom darkness of space raises a series of questions for astronomers and physicists. Why are these regions colder? Is this the result of some events that occurred in the early stages of the universe, or is it a sign of a new physical phenomenon that we were previously unaware of? Research conducted so far has not been able to provide definitive answers to these questions, 